hi guys welcome to engineering youtube channel um as you can see these are some electronics components and what we will be doing today is to see what it is made of to see what is inside all these electronic components so that's a capacitor and this is a resistor um then the next is a um, this is a transistor this is also a transistor this capacitor this capacitor is called a film capacitor while the other one is called okay this is also a ceramic capacitor then this is a diode this is a diode it allows flow of current in one direction then this is also a diode this diode is used for rectification it also allows flow of current in one direction then this is a capacitor too so now we are going to start with this capacitor this small capacitor we are going to start opening it i want to destroy it and see what it looks like inside of this capacitor the capacitor is proving hard to open so i may use i may use more force for it so as to see it open i think i'm going to get a knife so as to make my work faster i've spent so much time on it i'm going to get a knife to open it i've gotten a knife so i think it will be much easier now for me to um to destroy it with a knife so as you can see it was so fast i was able to remove the content so that looks like a paper in an oil it looks like a paper in oil so let me open that rubber top and see what the paper looks like as you can see it's kind of wet so i'll just unwrap the paper and see what is inside so the liquid that um, we are seeing on the paper is called an electrolyte so this um, particular capacitor is called an electrolytic capacitor so let me continue unwrapping it as you can see you can see an aluminium sheet together with the paper the paper that is being um, covered with um, the electrolytes so let me continue let me continue unwrapping it so as you can see i have finished unwrapping it so you can see there are two terminals one terminal is connected to yeah one terminal is connected to the aluminium sheet and the other terminal is connected to the electrolytes of the paper and enclosed in this aluminium casing so this is what an electrolytic capacitor looks like in the inside this is what it is made of so i'm going to move to this next capacitor this is called a ceramic capacitor so i'm also going to break it and see what the inside looks like so after breaking the blue protective coating you can see um, a substance like um, like ceramic inside actually this is made from ceramic as you can see the brownish ceramic content in it as you can see clearly this um, capacitor has a ceramic which serves as the dielectric as you can see a wire that is connected to it that wire serves as the connector one is connected to the um, ceramic which is the dielectric and the other is connected to the electrode as you can see in the video So we will move to this next one. This is called a film capacitor. So it's different from 
um, that ceramic capacitor even though they look somehow the same so i'm going to open this now so i have opened it and as you can see um this is a metal foil it's in film that is made from aluminium so let me finish opening it so you can see everything so i have finished opening it let me use this knife to cut the center of the film at yeah, the center of the aluminium aluminium foil so as you can see i have opened it so i'm just trying to unwrap the um the metal film with, that is the aluminium foil so we can see what is inside of the aluminium foil so um i have begun opening it so as you can see i'm now opening the aluminium foil so guys this is where um, i'm almost through i've almost unwrapped the aluminium foil it's a very 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 long wrap so as you can see i have finished unwrapping it so this is the last this is the last part So as you can see, it seems like there's nothing inside, it's just inside the wrapper, inside the aluminium foil. So it's just um, an aluminium foil that has been wrapped. As you can see, this is the wrapper that was wrapped and then enclosed in the casing. Yeah, this is the casing. Enclosed in the casing. So this um, aluminium foil is serve as the dielectric. So the next is this transistor. I'm going to destroy this transistor and see what it looks like inside. So let me break it. So I have broken it and this is what it looks like inside. Yeah, this is what a transistor looks like inside. So this is what it looks like inside. Um, so you know a transistor has three terminals, the emitter, the gate and the collector. Uh, so I'm going to break these two, I'm going to destroy these two and see what this one looks like inside also. Okay, so I finished breaking it and this is what, it's look, what it looks like, just like the other first transistor I destroyed. They look very similar. Yeah, here the gates, emitter and collector um, terminals were broken off. So I'm going to move to this diode next. I'm going to destroy this diode to see what it looks like inside. So after I've broken it, um, this is what it looks like. As you can see, the terminal is connected to um, the materials in the materials in the diode. Usually, what is inside a diode is uh, a semiconductor. It can be a silicon or a germanium. So I think this is a silicon that is inside. So this is exactly how it is inside a diode.